Let's think about what happens when you divide a number by 10. When you divide a number by 10, each digit in the number being divided moves down one place value position. So what would happen if you divided a number by a power of 10? Well, in this example, we have 5 and 2 tenths divided by 10 to the power of 2. So 5 and 2 tenths is going to be divided by 10 two times, which means that each digit in the number is going to move down to place value spots. So what are we going to put in our tenth spot? Well, since there are no tenths, we're going to use the digit that represents nothing, which is 0. Now let's go over how we can work out these problems very quickly. In these examples, 12 and 4 tenths is divided by 10 to the second power. So 12 is being divided by 10 two times. So each digit will move down two place value spots. And an easy way to show that is just by moving the decimal point. So, so 12 and 4 tenths divided by 10 to the second power equals 124 thousandths. In the next example, 189 divided by 10 to the fourth power, each digit will move down four place value spots. So where is our decimal point? Our decimal point is always located right after the digit that is in the ones place. So it's here. Sometimes you may have to draw it. And we're going to, and to illustrate these digits moving down in value, we're going to move the decimal four places forward. We can't leave any place value spot empty, so we need to put a zero in for our tenths place.